Hello friends, it's Jim O'Rear. Welcome back to Jim O'Rear's Wacky World. We are out here at the Westgate River Ranch Resort and Rodeo. And currently, there's a haunting going on. Yes, out here at River Ranch, Florida at the Westgate Resort, they're having a huge Halloween event. Stuff for kids, stuff for adults, but the nighttime stuff, there's something spooky happening with a clown. Yes, apparently there was a clown that was maimed by a bull and the people just took him and threw him in the woods and he came to an untimely death, which is where he was found by a voodoo queen that brought his spirit back to life and now his devious spirit wanders these grounds. So I wore my killer clown shirt today, just hoping that I may be a little bit more safe on the clown side. We're gonna find out. So if you've been wondering about what the haunting at River Ranch is, we are here in River Ranch, Florida to give you a peek. River Ranch is one of the oldest working ranches in the United States, and they've even got a rodeo there that's been going on for 60 years. Well, Westgate River Ranch Resort and Rodeo are now putting on the haunting at River Ranch. And this is a lot of Halloween fun and activities for the entire family, kids, adults, they do recommend the nighttime stuff uh, to be a little more adult oriented, but uh, they've got uh, uh, pumpkin patches and hay rides and uh, scare zones and a maze. And even the hay ride that traditionally is usually very, very scary is suitable for children, except that you have to walk through this to get there. So more about that in just a moment. Let's take a look at the grounds out here in the daylight before we go to nighttime. Um, like I said, there's tons of stuff for kids to do out here. Here's some, some bowling and some hilly billy slides, uh, lots of photo opportunities, um, just really cute decor and things for the kids to do in this huge field. There is even this adorable corn maze that is perfect for kids and it's not you know really a corn maze it's chain link set up to look like a maze but uh look when we go in here it, it's super cute this is a super cute maze and even as an adult i liked it uh and they have different zones in here there's a ghost zone and you go through the maze and there's little ghosts everywhere and try and find your way around and you know you'll run into dead ends like this and oh there's there's a ghost blocking that way so, uh, all right, we got to go back over here and we'll go right over here and oh, no, there's another ghost. Um, but really cute stuff for, for the kids. They've really done this maze up uh, uh, wonderfully. I, I, I love how they, they've done this. Um, and, uh, you know, and as the, the kids come out of there, they can go. Uh, there's there's thing to climb on. There's bouncy places. Uh, but here's the barn right here. This is where the spooky stuff starts happening at night and uh you know if you're hungry you may want to eat before you go do this at night uh while i was there i went to the river ranch cattle company which is right there just right across from the haunted stuff to grab a bite you can watch another video about river ranch cattle company on this channel but uh for now let's turn off the lights and take a look at night and it lights up really pretty look at this field lit up really pretty um and you see there's still kids out there playing at night uh i love this little this little racetrack with some tricycles that you can you can race around and i wanted to do this actually just get out there and just bounce as high as you can um but all right i i'm distracted back to the spooky stuff we're gonna go over here to the barn now this is where the scare zone is and like i said earlier you've got to go through a scare zone to get to the hayride and the hayride follows the curse of kiko clown which i had mentioned earlier it's a story that follows uh follows you through the the hayride and and uh you know you get to sort of see what's going on but first like i said here we go <laughs> Uh -huh. 
If you survive that scare zone that Jeremy was running, you're gonna go right out the other side and get loaded onto this giant truck bed. You see, it seats a lot of people. It's a big truck. So we sat down and on our particular ride, Elaine here gives you a little background on the story of Kiko the Clown and the town that you're gonna ride into as well as some basic rules to follow while you're, uh, you're on the hayride. And then when we were ready to go, Carlos cranked it up and just took us right on out onto this little road here through the fields and uh, right over to the beginning of the hayride. And this hayride, you enter the town of Kiko and basically you're looking for the demented clown. And there are other characters out there. You know, there's a, there's a little hotel, there's a saloon. It's like a little Wild West town. And all these characters are kind of Wild West type characters that you are trying to help locate uh, the clown and uh, try and try and end the curse of the clown. And, and there he is right there. <laughs> a lot of fun. And he comes out and interacts. And like I said, they don't, um, it, it's not like a traditional hayride where they're, they're jumping all over everything and, you know, running chainsaws in your face and stuff like that. Uh, there's the, the voodoo witch, but they do come out and interact with you on the hayride and talk to you and, um, you know, try and get you to help them find and, and catch the clown who there is hiding behind the barn. But it's a, it's a story-driven type hayride through a Wild West town. And, and as you can see, if you're worried about if your, your kids can take it or not, that's sort of sort of what it looks like there, if you can get through those, those chainsaws in the scare zone. Um, and then as you wrap it up, which is about 45 minutes later, the ride is about 45 minutes, you're going to leave that, uh, that town of Kiko behind and head back to where you began. It's a lot of fun. There you go. That is a look at all the fun at the Westgate River Ranch Resort and Rodeo Haunting of River Ranch. It's awesome. It's going on for a little bit longer out here in October. So much fun. A lot of stuff for the kids with little little corn mazes and uh, playgrounds to play on. You've got the you know all the spooky stuff that's a little more oriented for the adults. There's some fine dining out here at some restaurants. It's a really, really cool place to come and check out for Halloween. But not only Halloween, you can come out here and stay, you know, rent a place. There's RV spots, there's, tending, there's tent places uh, to set up. It's amazing. Check out their website, find out more about it, uh, you know, how you can come out here, how you can get packages for the haunting at River Ranch, uh, as well as just uh, checking it out anytime during the year. So I hope you enjoyed watching this video. If you have, click that like button to let the powers that be know that you like the video. And while you're at it, click on follow or subscribe, and you'll be notified when I upload new videos. So thanks again for watching. We'll see you next time.